Hey guys, what's up? It's your girl, AI the Great. And today, I'm coming at you with another great video. Please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. My content is fragrances, fashion, beauty, and lifestyle. Now let's get started. Yes, I absolutely love date night. Mm. Now for my fragrance of the night. What am I gonna choose? What am I gonna choose? Hmm. Mm. <sighs> Not feeling you either. I don't know, I'm feeling classy and sexy. Ooh. Mon Guerlain. Yes. Yes. Scent of the night. Now, I'm ready. <laughs> it's so silly. I can't even deal. Here comes our waiter. I'm going to order another one. Yeah. Hey, are you guys ready to order? Wait a minute. Someone smells absolutely amazing at this table. Why, thank oh, you. Oh, no, it isn't you. I can't smell you at all. It's you, sir. You smell great. <laughs> Has that ever happened to you guys? Someone comes over and is like, Oh, someone smells good over here and you just know it's you and it wasn't you and it's like womp 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 but <laughs> now I did a video in the past I'm gonna link it above actually of fragrances that you do not overspray so I decided to follow that video up with fragrances that you do need to overspray now let me put out this disclaimer or not a disclaimer let me be truthful with you guys I overspray 99.9% .9 of my fragrances. Even the ones that you don't have to overspray, I overspray because that's just what I do. And when I say overspray, it's nothing cute. Guys, I spray until I choke. Like I have a bubble that I'm in and I spray and then this bubble gets too, you know, too much and then I start suffocating and choking and then I move over to the next bubble if I feel like I'm, you know, I need more sprays. Yeah, it's really bad. And I am going to show you guys in a vlog at some point. I'm not sure if you're going to, if you've seen it already or if you're going to see it, a way that I use creams to make my fragrances last longer. But so in this video, we're just going to talk about these fragrances that you definitely need to overspray. If you want somebody to smell it on you, you overspray it. You try to layer up with creams, you spray it on your clothes you need to overspray these fragrances. And once you overspray them, then you're gonna get four to five hours, you know, yeah. You'll get three to five hours with these. So let's start with Poison Girl EDT. Guys, this is a beautiful fragrance. I love it. I've been looking for the Poison Girl Eau de Parfum and I cannot find it. So I have the EDT and it is amazing. Mm, so beautiful. So it's bitter orange, damask rose, rose from grass, almond, vanilla, and tonka bean. Now, do you hear those notes? This is like a false dream. But you don't really smell it on you. Like, you definitely need to overspray this fragrance here. Even this pale colored juice. I feel like if I had the Eau de Parfum, it would perform a little better. So I'm still on the hunt for that. Let me know if you guys have the Eau de Parfum of Poison Girl and where'd you get it from? Because I need it. Our next fragrance is Jo Malone Wood, Sage, and Sea Salt. Guys, this right here is Bay. Like this is Bay Bay. I absolutely love this fragrance. I know that it has no longevity and you know, no projection, but I have the shower gel and the body cream and I layer and I over spray like like nobody's business like i'll go through this like water because that's how much i spray it oh mm, this is so beautiful so it's amber seeds sea salt and sage 
definitely a beautiful scent that everybody needs in their collection. I wear this in the spring, in the summer. I'm gonna try to wear it in the fall as well, which is now, so I should wear this soon. I'm gonna wear this soon and see how it performs in the cold. Cause I usually like to wear this in the fall and in the spring and summer months. This reminds me of vacation. Cause this to me smells like fresh air sea salt, like a warm sea salt. Like if you're on the beach, and there's like that nice warm sea breeze. That's what this smells like to me. But in a prettier, more perfumed way. Love this. Woods Agency Salt Overspray. Our next oversprayer is Tom Ford's Metallique. Guys, this is a beautiful vanilla ice cream, powdery vanilla ice cream with like sprinkled powdered sugar type of scent. And when I say vanilla ice cream, it's cold, it has that cold feeling like ice cream. But this is a skin scent. This has no projection. Um, this is definitely a skin scent. So if I want people to smell this, I spray it on my clothes and I heavily spray this. Tom Ford's Metallique. You need to overspray this one here. Our next fragrance is one of my favorite fragrances to wear in the summer, and that's Tom Ford's Soleil Blanc. And I haven't smelled this, guys, in such a long time, so I'm going to spray this one. Mm, this reminds me of vacation. Mm, listen, so it's bergamot, cardamom oil, or fur, pistachio accords, ylang ylang, benzoin, and coco de mer. And this is summer in a bottle but you need to overspray. And I also have the oil, there's a body oil, and there's a shimmering oil, which doesn't have much of a scent, um, but I do have the body oil and I overspray this. And once I overspray, I'm getting, you know, like four to five hours on my skin. But I love this. Tom Ford's Soleil Blanc. Next, we have Chanel Gabrielle Essence. And guys, this is the essence, so you do get a little bit more of longevity and projection with the essence in the po as opposed to the original, but you still need to overspray. This isn't one of those cute, dainty, here, 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 and here. No, this is a, you're going ham and spraying this on yourself. I love this. It's Jasmine, Ylang Ylang, Orange Blossom, and Tuberose. And I'm gonna spray this one as well. I usually have my test strips, but I forgot to pull them out. Mmm. Just a classy, classic, beautiful scent. Love this. Chanel Gabrielle Essence. And again, I have the shower gel, the body cream, and I overspray. And now we have the MVP, the most valuable player in this group here. This is Mon Guerlain. Guys, I will link a video of a review that I did on this fragrance um, in the first weeks of me starting my channel. This fragrance, I it's one that I love to hate because I love it and I will always have it in my collection. This is, I have this here, I have my backup bottle. I never wanna be out of this fragrance. I always buy the shower gels and the body lotions. It's just something that I always re-up on because I love this fragrance. But it pisses me off that it doesn't last long on my skin. And I know that it does last long on some people's skin, but as we know, fragrances perform differently on everyone. So, but the longevity on this fragrance is not great, you know, on anybody's, in my opinion, on anyone's skin. But for me, what I do, like I said, I layer with the body, with the body, um, the shower gel and the body cream, and I overspray. In my little skit in the beginning, I was trying to be cute and you know, do the little one here and one here, like how they do in the movies. No, this is one of those, like, you know, you go all the way up and down your arm. Do you, do you guys know that? And then you, all the way up and down the arm, you hit it here, you hit it behind your neck, behind your ear, behind your ear, in your chest. You know, if, if your legs are out, anywhere that there's skin, you're spraying and then once you're done with that and you let that soak in, then you spray the clothes. And then you spray it in the air and you walk into it. Guys, look at this. This is insane how I use this fragrance, but I love the scent. I want this to be one that people smell because it's such a beautiful vanilla scent. Let me tell you the notes. It's a warm and spicy oriental gourmand. There's bergamot, mandarin, pear, neroli, jasmine sandbag, lavender, iris, vanilla, and sandalwood. Guys beautiful beautiful fragrance beautiful classy 
sexy. Love this mon girl on. But don't try to be cute and do the mm mm mm. Now you got to do the mm 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 overspray. Leave it in the comments below and let me know fragrances that you have to overspray. Not the ones that you want to overspray because like I said in the beginning of the video, I overspray fragrances that I don't necessarily need to overspray because that's just what I do. I have a lot of fragrances, they won't go to waste, so I don't mind being very, very liberal in my sprays. So let me know fragrances that you have in your collection that you have to overspray. Where if you just do like one or two or three sprays, no one's gonna smell it on you. So let's talk about it in the comments below, guys. And remember to stay safe, be great, stay great, and always strive for greatness. AI the Great, signing out, but I'll see you on my next video. Peace.